What's up members of the barrio, it's John coming to you from Newark Airport and I'm usually not this excited at 6.30 in the morning but today we are starting our adventure in Puerto Rico and I'm gonna be vlogging the experience of flying there, getting to our Airbnb and giving you our first impressions of San Juan. Estoy muy dormida, tengo mucho sueño, pero estoy emocionada. ¿Y en inglés? I'm sleepy, but I'm excited to go. Her first time in Puerto Rico, my first time in Puerto Rico. Yeah. Thank you. I have been so anti-United Airlines for a while. My last couple of flights with them have been very, very good. So they're starting to grow on me again. Morning. Morning. I splurged on business class seats for us. No, just kidding. We are all the way in the back of the economy. Entertainment at every seat for this three hour, 10 minute flight. Again, United, they've been doing pretty well. I brought my good headphones for once. I usually forget them. So we're gonna watch movies. Hasta San Juan. Actually, maybe that doesn't look so good on camera. I just realized mm -hmm. people don't want to see me shirtless. That was definitely one of the coolest landings I can remember in a long while. It kind of reminded me of landing in Hilo, Hawaii, like we were entering the jungle. And I was pretty tired on the airplane, but I I'm suddenly getting a lot more energy to see old San Juan with my eyes. All right, we're going to take a taxi. There are no Ubers allowed to pick people up in the airport here. So that's going to be our first interaction with Puerto Rico. Guys, I have a, a new announcement for you. You can use Uber at the airport. I just talked to information people because I kept seeing signs for rideshare. And uh, yeah, we're going to take an Uber from San Juan Airport. I was totally ready for a taxi, but Uber's even better. So the first unintended tip for this trip to San Juan, Uber's going to be about $12. If you took a touristic taxi, the set rate, I believe, is $19. So definitely go with Uber from San Juan Airport if you want. Left the cold for this hot temperature. Yeah, we just had, I mean, we had, we had this weather like two, three months ago, but <laughs> we're back. Where are you from? Uh, New York. New York. I was born in New York. Oh, nice. And I lived here until I was 13 years old, so I've been here all my life. Forgot what air conditioning felt like in a car. <laughs> All the houses with different colors. It's a lot of a lot of streets have squares like this. The plazas. This is Plaza Colon. Plaza Colon, right? We're meeting tomorrow. Right. Plaza Colon. And on the back there, you got the the port and where the cruise ships come in. You have a beautiful view. Oh yeah. <laughs> Bye bye. Bye. View outside our Airbnb is absolutely spectacular. We're we're gonna explore that, but first I want to go inside. If Every person in Puerto Rico is as cool as our Uber driver was from the airport. It's gonna be a very nice trip. We could have booked a hotel in Old San Juan or in Condado, but I wanted to get a more authentic feel for Old San Juan. So I decided to book an Airbnb. And before we even begin the tour of the Airbnb, I just wanna show you the view when you step out the door. Honestly, nothing too fancy. It's exactly what I wanted. Just, you know, feels local. Little place to eat, desk, refrigerator, view outside, I'm gonna keep showing that. I grew up in a beach town in Mexico. Well, I used to go there a lot with my grandmother, so the smell of the breeze, uh, plus an old house, reminds me of my childhood, so I'm so happy right now. Shameless plug if you're looking for $40 off your first Airbnb booking. See our referral link in the description. Yes, there is air conditioning. No, we are not using it just yet. And it's cozy. I get used to this. We're gonna be here for four nights. 
the banyo. Nice size shower. I like the vibe of this apartment. I love the location. It costs about $120 a night after fees to stay here, but one of the big selling points was the ocean view from your front door. So I think they, they put that in the listing and I was kind of sold ever since then. Sorry guys, I woke up at four in the morning. <laughs> I can't think. All right, we gotta put some shorts on and we're gonna head out to Old San Juan and give you those first impressions that we promise in the video title. Adriana's got her big hat on. Yeah, I feel ridiculous, but I don't wanna get a tummy for the wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, our, uh, our wedding is coming up next month in Mexico. That will be another video. So it's time to make some first impressions of San Juan. And we've barely seen anything so far, except for these colorful buildings everywhere. All right, really first impressions of old San Juan. Gorgeous, I know that most of San Juan does not look like this. I, I did my homework. I know it was established in the 16th century. It has the Spanish colonial style. Actually, it reminds me a lot of uh, Trinidad, Cuba, where I spent a week about two years ago. So I, I knew that coming in, but just, just to be here, to feel it, to feel that ocean breeze and all the colors here, it's truly something else. Guys, we're gonna try some authentic Puerto Rican food right here at Burger King. You ready? No, just kidding. Actually, we're going somewhere very famous. Shout out to my friend Greg in New York for recommending this as our first stop in San Juan. Try some food. We're gonna eat a Mallorca. You'll see what it is. Hola. Hola. Dos Mallorcas? Guys, these cost about $1.50 each. They are just drowned in powdered sugar, and uh, Adriana's gonna go first. We're gonna eat Mallorca's named after the famous island in Spain. Mm. I love it. What's it taste like? Bread is super sweet, even without the sugar, I think. But of course the sugar gives it an extra. But even when you see a lot of sugar on it, it's not super sweet, which I like. So I don't like super sweet things. I think I can eat three of this. Trying a Mallorca, first time. Hmm. It's nice and doughy, and as Adriana said, it's really not as sweet as you would think with all this powdered sugar. Mm. That second bite was much better. That was a lunch of champions right there. We are gonna walk a little bit more, explore, and give you some more of our impressions of old San Juan, but so far so good. A little bit of uh, the town, the city, and what I like is the architecture. It has a lot of beautiful colors. It reminds me a lot of places, of course, in Mexico, Spain. John says Cuba. I've never been there, but I've seen pictures, and I agree. And I love the breeze. It has a, a specific smell. This area, it's, it's. I don't know. It feels like home. I like it. We've only spent an hour in Old San Juan, and these are just first impressions, but so far I'm a huge fan of it. As Adriano was saying, the architecture, the, the colonial vibe here. I realize that this is the really touristy part of San Juan and of Puerto Rico, and the rest of the country doesn't necessarily all look like this, but from the small little picture we've gotten so far, I think it's going to be a good trip, and we have a very big video coming up after this one. I'm going to put a card to it. It's gonna be a guide to San Juan, things to do. We've plotted out and planned so many different activities. We're gonna be showing you all around. So I think it's gonna be a great video. Stay tuned for it. And thank you so much for watching. Tell me down below in the comments uh, what you think of San Juan. Have you ever been here before? I'm curious. 
Till next time, guys.